There we go. So right now I'm looking at uh, Saber and Zero ships in the new dev build. We'll just come here to check it out and see what we can make of this new patch. I'm going to say I'm using the realistic uh, texture pack right now with the bump mapping, but I'm just trying to find evidence of bumps. <laughs> uh, it gave me the error message when I tried to log in with it, and so I don't know if it's actually working. Well, it didn't give the error when I went into the realistic texture pack with it on. Oh, really? Okay. I'm just being safe and using the default. And, uh, yeah, it's a really nice use of the wedges there, buddy. Oh, I designed this with these new wedges in mind. Oh, I see. I was going to say, it does fit really well. And I will probably end up redesigning this thing to give it a slimmer profile. Very nice. And I must say, the, uh, the colors are fantastic on your uh, sail ship. Yeah, definitely, except for the sails, which they turn out black in the, uh, with the doors, but... That's right. Yeah, I could deal with that. Yeah, they actually look like doors' doors, don't they? I suppose you could say it was mm -hmm. a black sail instead. Yeah, it's just a slightly different design, I guess. You got different Mylar sails from another, uh, another distributor. Yeah. There you go. This is essentially what the sails on the RLS Legacy War were. Uh, compact Mylar. Well, they were solar sails, so they actually had some different properties to own. But... Who wants to fly over to 666 then? Sure thing. I'm afraid to. Do you, uh... Oh, wait, never mind. I can't it's the blue anything. planet. If, the... if you look up and to the left, there's a big blue planet. If you just fly there, that's it. Yeah, Zero's got oh, it. Word. Yeah, right, right between us and the sun. Yep. Alright, I'm jumping down. I, I was gonna say, hey, feel free to hop on and ride over there, but... You oh, I'll ride with you. Hang on, I'll ride with you. Hang on. I'll ride with you. Hang on. Well, if it'll work, I'd... Where's the gravity? Just... Well, let's try it out. That's a good... good uh, gravity's up. Well, this will be the test to see if gravity actually retains crossing sector boundaries yet. That'd be so nice. That's, like, the only thing I'm wishing for. Okay, yeah, I'm at the gravity, wherever you're at. Okay, I can't well, pick up the shot. I... and then I'm gonna... Guys... Pop off real quick to upload something. Guys, I can't pick mm -hmm. up the ship core. Yeah, that's oh, an yeah. issue that currently exists with it. Uh, no matter how long you hold it, it won't work. The only way to pick it back up is to in enter build mode and remove it. What? Yep. But it's a ship core. You can't yep. do that. No. Ship core right now is the only element the fabricator cannot pick up. I discovered that messing around with uh, Saber and Dalmont on one of the previous dev builds. Mm -hmm. Oh, I got it. Alright, there you go. Alright, you got the gravity. Okay, let's so see that's the first works. tip for everyone then. If you're trying to get out of the core, you can remove it in build mode. There you go. Interesting. I suppose if it's the last block, then it's okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah, it makes sense. Unlike the build block, where you just take it off and you just get kicked out. And you're like, whoa! <laughs> Whoops. I don't know if you ever hit your own build block in gravity. Oh, or in symmetry. There, done that. Um, hey, you want evidence of bump mapping? Come and take a look at the floor here. The brown hull has definitely got bump maps on it. Because that looks like tiles on my screen. Okay. Alright, yeah, I don't know how close the sector here. boundary is, but let me know if you get teleported somewhere. Yeah, because the brown's got a kind of tile. Oh, you'll hear about it, don't worry. I'll just be like, whoa, where'd the ship go? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Um, that blue planet is in 555, not 666. Yeah, we gotta go through it. Ramming speed! Sorry, I didn't bring Are the god-moded Starman to go through it. Dude, I'm still on the ship! Dude, we've switched sectors a couple times now. I'm gonna try doing, like, a rotation or something. Because if this is fixed, then, oh man, uh, all my... Bombs are over. Happy day. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I think it's fixed, mate, because we're in 333. We've definitely gone mm -hmm. through at least one sector. Keep going, man. I'm not falling off it from rolling. You know that. 
I'm a parkour Sweet. king. Ooh. <laughs> well, you can he's climb to the top of the mast and try it. Oh, there you go. I see you up there. I've got a camera up at the front of the uh, four mast. Oh, crap. Yeah, we just switched again. You're still there. Um, or not oh, Saber, okay. but uh, Apex is Battlestar. Oh, man. I'm so happy right now. <laughs> Amazing! Like, I can't even begin to describe it, because now I can just cruise around the systems with, you know, people just exploring, just hanging up, hanging onto this thing, climbing up the masts and all that. Amazing. Uh, yeah, what sector are we in now? 444. So we're just going to be skirting around this planet, and then we should be there. I should get a great view. Definitely. Oh man, actually, you know what, I'm going to record this as well, because this is fantastic. Okay, what's up, guys? Uh, we are currently in the dev build Tamino-sama zero, is it zero cent or zero cent? Zero cent. Zero cent. Um, zero cent and myself, and we, I, yeah, we all just discovered collectively that now gravity is fixed. Where if you switch sectors with someone else in there, you can see right up there Tom bouncing around, and we've been switching sectors, and he's been hanging on. So I am indescribably happy about this right now. But we're actually going to check out Tom's base that he loaded in. That was a sector. And, uh, or sectors. Oh. Whoa, uh oh. Looks like you kind of bounce around now. I had some lag there. Whoa, and some more. We just popped someplace. Okay, 655. Where are we going at? Is docking invalidation okay. off yet? Not on this server, no, do it. Yeah, no, not yet. Alright. It's pretty much running vanilla on this. Oh, I can see a hangar. Land ahoy! Are you right. shooting at it? Uh, docking invalidation. Yes. Oh, 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 wow, we can have scouts with a high draw distance go out on front. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Who's got the highest draw distance? Get out in the crow's nest. Uh, it's, it's not me. <laughs> so, yeah, you I'm can help right up there if you want. I'd be running 20. If it wasn't for the sun. Wait for the star. There we go. I've got a silhouette. Oh, oh, what happened? I'm getting some fantastic bloom right there. Oh, oh no, I there it is. There it is. Lag. There we go. So, which side is that? Uh, I think we're looking oh, at the no, bottom no. of it. Yeah. Go, if you go. Oh, okay. If you go the way I'm. Can you see where I'm shooting? Yeah, yeah. If you go up go. that way. Right, I'm, gonna, I'm oh, shooting oh, at oh, the oh, dock oh, where oh, I put my. Something to start working on in the, in the dev build. That's the way you oh, want to go. Oh, oh, there's the hangar. I see it. We've got Sweet. pirates, and uh, this thing doesn't have any weapons. Pirates, huh? I'll take them. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Avast. <laughs> oh, wow. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Interesting. Yeah, like I said, I'm getting a little bit of lag. Yeah, yeah, I'm seeing that. Up there. Oh, I can see a stealth board over there. The uh, the pirates are to our right, I believe. Our starboard. Oh, yeah, I see him. I see him. Oh, there we go. Oh, did you jump off? Yep. Okay, just make sure. They're they're all dead. What killed Zero them? Zero was killing. I, I don't know. Like Zero uh, or maybe the turrets. Oh, okay. Then I have no idea. I can see your ship over on the station already. You you've been here for ages, haven't you? Waiting for us. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, buddy. That's fine. Oh, the admin bike. Hang on. <laughs> oh, that looks weird. Let's see if I can dock this thing over here. Well, the control panel looks different. Wow. Yeah. It, it actually like says nav easy. on it. Look, I've actually got buttons on my admin bike now. <laughs> Hang on, I'm going to have to come and bring and show you this. Yeah, there's definitely bump mapping on some of the textures. Not all of them, but definitely on some of them. You can see like a, sort of like a tile, like a bathroom tile effect. Nice. Whoops, I just hit my train. Oh, uh, oh dear. You derailed your own train. <laughs> I 
It actually looks really interesting with the with the bump mapping on. There's like it makes it look like there's tiles on everything basically. Well, only on the hardened hulls, I think. Oh yeah, yeah, I see what you're saying. I think I loaded in. Because it just looks like a bit more than image, you know. It looks like they're sort of lifting a bit. Yeah. And it kind of rounds the corner off a bit, like so. It looks like the corners are kind of diagonal, you know. But it's definitely working. The bump mapping's definitely working. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. It so, kind of looks better from not real close up or like near rain, near. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know. The further away or the closer from a point, and it just doesn't really. You can't really see it. Hmm. I can ask Whoa. Help. Hello, my ship. What happened? Haha, <laughs> made it back on. <laughs> yeah. Oh, did I? Oops. That's alright, no, I, I actually had quite a daring leap. <laughs> you bumped it and I was like, ah, so You I jumped can't. and you made it. Yeah, I I no and way. I <laughs> what a jump. That was fantastic. I will be right back. It, appear it right. appears I am needed elsewhere. Well, thank you, Best Zero. Oh, what did I do? Whoa. Uh oh. Oh, you're caught in the rigging, I think. Oh no. Girl. It's the turret, mate. It's because I'm not used to having a turret. Because just. Right. Oh man, you're stuck good. <laughs> oh, 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 wait. There it goes. There it's out now. Solved. Think, maybe. There you go. That works. <laughs> Sorry about the turbulence. Oh, I haven't... No, that's all right. I, uh, I actually didn't show off my texture yet. Okay, so as you can see, Tom's sporting there my texture. Um, texture, or sorry, player skins aren't currently uh, shared across the server yet. But you can see there that I made a nice little Tron skin that he's modeling quite well. <laughs> so the uh, with the new um, specular maps that they've got, then it'll actually allow you to do, um, like it'll make it look like something's glowing because you can see that he's in the shadow there but you know you can still see plainly the lights that are in there so i actually did this before they added the specular maps i kind of had to like alter some of their code to uh make my own but now they added it so it's really accessible for everybody and it looks fantastic if i do say so myself and then i've also got an orange version so that way it matches like the uh, uh like clue or any of the quote unquote bad people from tron but this is the, the lovely user skin. <laughs> He's having a bump. It's, it's so nice having these animations now because it's not just randomly floating around. Now we just need like front flips and stuff. <laughs> I try and get away and they just keep pulling me back. There's no escape. Yeah. Well, at least I know my laptop won't kill me if I have two clients running at once. Provided I don't do much of anything in either. Alright. So, uh, what do you fellas want to do next? I was... I'm just going to check out my lab. So rudely interrupted as it were oh, with yeah, yeah, good, calling of a higher power I was going to spawn in the Macross and start getting it turreted and working on it some do it I don't know man well, you think if I climb the top of the mast I can make that jump I've got the solution what's the number for build block 123 I've got a shuttle saber. Oh no. Oh. Yeah, that'll work too. I was going to see if I could jump from the mast. Oh wait, no, no. Wait, I can totally... If I go out here on the rigging... Oh no, I fell. <laughs> Dang it. I was going to say, if I go out like on the actual rigging in the mast... I could you could have made it. Where did you fall? Oh, there you are. Yeah, yeah. I just walked on the wrong spot of the platform. Try again. I can recover you. I got a build block on the back of the core. Alright, here we go. Oh, I can totally make this. It goes right over the edge. It does kind of bug me though that now if you hold E looking down at about 45 degrees, you don't go any faster. Ta-da! 
it. <laughs> no, I just need some gravity because I'm doing kind of a weird lean thing right now. Jump in. There we go. Oh, wait, no, hang on. I hit it twice on accident. It's kind of hard when they both look the same. There we go. I'm in. Cool. Haha, <laughs> look at the skin for the permission block. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> P. Right. <laughs> Having those Mario flashbacks, are you? <laughs> <laughs> A little power sphere. Right. I assume it meant power. I have no idea. I think it's just a power sphere. I'm just waiting for lightsabers. Oh man, that'd be fantastic. Um, if you go into third-person camera mode and right-click, it kind of looks like you're holding a lightsaber. I think that's what gave me the right, the idea. Oh, it does. It totally does. Nice. <laughs> Fantastic. And who is this user? Geronimo! Wee! Oh yeah, I saw your video about your little boxing ring. That's actually what gave me the idea to do uh, do those for... Oh, I don't think you've seen my planet yet. I've been doing no. quite a bit of work the past no, day or so. I now have some fences that have the uh, little factory enhancer like you got here inspired me to use those. Sweet. Well, I thought they're cool and no one uses them, so let's just use mm -hmm. them anyway, even though we can't use them for what they're for anymore. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I've, I've seen them used once in um, in a Thunderdome server at uh, a place called Space R Us, I think it was, Yeah. where they made a bunch of different things, and they used those to make like really cool tunnel things. Ooh, but, yeah, I know how you mean, yeah. They were great for little barriers. It looks a bit different, and also, whenever I press space, I don't know if you've noticed this, but the whole game gets lighter. Um, is that happening for you? It? No. If you hit, like, I found a few things that do weird hmm. things with the lighting. Like, if, if you hit one on the numpad, it kind of, like, makes things, like, makes the light or the glow or something less. Oh, that um, doesn't like happen for me. I don't know. Oh, it doesn't? Maybe, maybe I've got the opposite. If you hit F12, it does some weird stuff too. Like it makes all your water oh yeah, the transparency. Like water. Yeah, the transparency doesn't work. Yeah. Well, look at this. Except Ready? Okay, not space. Space. So I'm gonna wait until he lands. Like every time I'm jumping, but everything, everything's brighter. Huh? That's weird. And when I stop, and when I stop, it stops. <laughs> You know what this is like? It's like that new smart glass where like you push a button and then the glass becomes opaque. That's exactly what it's like. Except it obviously it's just client side. <laughs> right, well, yeah. see the sights. Yeah. The water does look I've, really good in this texture pack. Yeah, the water looks good, but I will say though that it looks a bit, you know, the vegetation, I don't know, there's something about it. Uh, let's go check it out. It, it looks a bit deserty, though. Mm. And like, I don't think it's just the texture pack. I think it actually is with all the shadows now. It's, but look at these flowers, though. They do look pretty good. Right. Well, yeah. Oh, here we go. Hmm. Oh, this area looks mark. pretty sweet. Yeah, this is nice. Yeah, it's not too bad. But yeah, I, I do see what you mean. It's really. Uh, it makes it seem more like just clumps of weeds because it doesn't cover as much. But I guess it's not as bad from the side. It's just when you get up close to them. I love this bloom effect. It's so nice. I haven't got the bloom effect on this time round. Oh man, it's it's so fantastic. Because like it, you just get shafts of light coming in through the window. Yeah, I mean, I, I must admit, I'm not using shadows for this video, but I will. Ooh, I will start using them against oh, you. Oh, okay. Well, you'll have to check this out when uh, I upload mine then. Nice. Because yeah, it's like I said, it is a lot darker, but I mean, it's still very nice. Hmm. All right. Well. 
Ah, oh, so the leaves have bump maps on. I'll get me a core, core cab. Okay, I'll uh, head over that way. Oh, I don't have a core. Oh, uh, do you have another build block? Because I've got a core, I think. I just don't think I have a build block. Yep. Okay. Well, I'll just try out the core then. There you go. Teamwork. Yo. <laughs> you in? Yeah, I'm in. Cheese looks good. <laughs> is that what that is? Yeah, man, that's my cheese barn. It's got nice. no roof, though. Well, I mean, it's space, so I mean, you're keeping it vacuum sealed. Hey, Zero! Okay, that should keep Slate passive for about two hours. <laughs> Ten minutes. Well, I just went and defashioned quite literally everything in his sector. Oh. Got two blocks. Nice. Oh, there you go. Just the two at the back. Are you both in, are you? I'm in. I'm in the very back, most one. Okay. He's in the caboose. It's a very nice cheese vault you have there, Tom. <laughs> Thanks, man. You should use some of the new wedges to make it look like you have chunks taken out of big blocks. <laughs> that would be great. Maybe a space mice. So, uh, what oh, that's weird. Hey, hang on. Hmm? What is weird here? Look at, look at, look at the damage where Whoa. I've left the damage. What's going on with damage to blocks? Look oh, at that. That's right. Yeah, no, they they added it so it looks more like fire. Oh, so that means damage to ships will look even more impressive. Yeah, like a big crater would look. Right, like, guys, we like need to spawn in. I'm still in there. default texture packs. <laughs> Do I need to change? Um, no, not necessarily, but uh, just so you know, um, in this texture pack, it's realistic. Um, it's got, like, it looks like uh, layers like. of fire, which are layered up. Mm -hmm. So there's more layers on the most damaged blocks. Mm. Yep. So it looks pretty sweet, actually. I'm really liking that, that effect. I mean, I probably won't yeah, use this technique again. <laughs> well, you've got, uh, you've got a ship that has missiles or something in it, right? Yeah. Okay, well, well you I was thinking. Shots at the legacy or something. Yeah, well, that's what, what I was thinking. I'm going to spawn in some ships and we'll do some. Uh, yeah, yeah, for sure. Let's make some holes, guys. Yeah, man. All right. I'll get you back to legacy. Oh, someone's dropped out there. Uh, so... No, I hopped oh, out. Yeah. I'm going to go to a sector nearby and I'm going to start okay. working on the Macross. Okay. Okie dokie. I'll drop you off and then I'll go and have a quick look at the ten shrooms. Alright, I'm out. <sighs> I'm just going to fly up there and come back because it's uh, big and slow. Okay, I'll just uh, hang out on here then. I'm also going to stop recording for now. The thing I really like about being able to sync this up with um, TeamSpeak is that I don't have to like sync up my audio outside of that because it just starts both of them instantly together. Oh right. Yeah, it's very good. Cool. From a distance, mate, I can't there's not much difference. From a distance it doesn't look different. It's just when you get up close there's all this extra detail that we don't have at the moment. Mm-hmm. Because that's the thing about the realistic texture pack I've been finding. The colours are about right, so at a distance, everything looks the same. Yeah. But... Um, 
which is nice. 